to evacuate, do as you are told. Today's events remind us of just how fragile life can be. My family hadn't seen my brother Tatsuhiro for almost a month, but we thought he was fine because he's a fearless survivor and strong man. Sadly, heaven took him and his body was found with no eyes near the ocean two months after. The mega tsunami took his precious eyes. He was in great spirit the night before the tsunami earthquake. He gave a speech to our entire family of how happy he is that he was finally having a baby boy and he was so excited to meet his unborn child. After the tsunami, Sendai was trying to rebuild, but many private lands are not guaranteed by the government to provide help. So there remains debris of people's broken lives. I was shocked to discover there were lots of bodies found with no fingers. The few nights after the earthquake, lots of ethnicity came and cut the fingers off in order to make passports. Others came to take kimono money and many women were kidnapped and raped. And a lot of people are not so organized yet and all the students went, went all the way up to the roof to escape and all the kids were scared. A few students died from it. This is actually right in front of the ocean. Went all the way up to the roof. In Kesenuma, I think they are still clearing up because the city was really devastated there and I think they really uh, need a lot more help at this moment. I think we, we have to get together and see if we can help other people uh, who, are, who are not able to, to get themselves back on their feet. もう人ともっと金が本当にもう一年過ぎてからつまらなくなり。という声をかけてくれるすごくあったかい社会が東北にはありました。今我々にできることっていうのはかなか知れてるかもしれないけどもできることをね何か探してそれを見つけたらもうすぐそれを行動していかないともう周りは何もしてくれないですからね。
でこれから先「復旧」があって「復興」という言葉がつながっていくと思うんですけれどもこれからの未来に進んでいくに従ってやはり末永いあの寄り添ったご支援をですねあの今後も、えー、皆様のお力をお借りして、えー、私たち助けられていかなければいけないと思いますあのこれからもですねこの被災地に対する思いあの皆様の思いを頂戴して私たちは頑張ってまいります I now have undying hope for Sendai I share with you.